Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. We're going to be doing a tarot card reading, which is going to be focused on the lunar eclipse in Leo happening on January 21st of 2019. This tarot card reading is going to be focused on the energy of the individual that you are dealing with. It applies to all zodiac signs. So the important messages are going to come out. During the lunar eclipse, it's normal to feel a surge of emotions and feelings. It's normal to be thinking about things that haven't healed from your past. It's also a good time to let go of certain things that need to be removed from your life. So what I'm noticing from the cards is that you are dealing with an individual that is hiding something from you. What they're hiding has a lot to do with a behind the scenes type of scenario. They could be working behind your back to try to make things happen between the two of you. They could be looking for a way back into your life. There's something that they're doing that is coming off as a bit of a sneaky behavior. So I do feel like this person is putting a lot of energy into something concerning you and they're hiding it. They don't want you to know that they're still interested, they still have a soft spot for you, they might still want to have another chance at a relationship. That's what I'm getting from this particular tarot card. Now, the next card is showing to me, what are they showing? They would like for things to move forward in the situation. So you could be getting communication from this individual. You could be getting some sort of movement. But I feel like this particular tarot card has to be clarified. In terms of what they want, they want to have a new beginning with you. They want to have a fresh start. They want to start over in this situation. And I feel like this individual is very amped for that, very motivated, very enthusiastic about getting things going in that direction. And this energy is going to be amplified when this lunar eclipse actually happens. So they're going to be even more motivated. The next tarot card is focused on what they don't want. I'm seeing that they don't want things to be over in this situation. They don't want to lose you. So in terms of what they are hiding, they've been thinking about you a lot. I'm seeing that. They could be also hiding a lot of sadness and pain inside of them, hiding disappointment, hiding the fact that they've been very pessimistic, very focused on the breakup or whatever happened between the two of you may have even been a fight. So this person has been very focused on what was lost. And we can see from this next card here that there's a great deal of caution in each step that they are following. They're being very strategic in terms of the next move they're making because they don't want to make any more mistakes. I feel like you're dealing with someone who may have made a lot of mistakes along the way. So they're going through a great deal of length to hide their sadness, to hide the fact that they've been very moody, they've been thinking about you a lot, they may have been trying to do things in the background to get over this, they may have been trying to find a solution in the situation. Now this individual would like things to move forward, they would like to communicate with you, but they are a little bit closed off, they are a little bit cautious that you might bite their head off or try to 
hurt them. So I think they're trying to be protective over their heart in a certain light. In terms of this individual's intention, I'm seeing that they do want to communicate with you during this period of time. There's a very great deal of emphasis on that. In terms of them wanting to have a new beginning, which is their main intention during this period of time, what I'm noticing is that if you've broken up with this person, a new beginning is right there up in terms of their priority. They really want to get the ball rolling for that to happen. They don't want to lose you. That's what I'm seeing from this card here. Yeah, they want to come back into your life. They want to take care of you. They want to be there for you. Okay. So what are they really feeling? They want to see movement. They want to see progress. But they're also feeling very, very stressed out. That's what I'm seeing with this card. A lot of cards have fallen out. I see that this individual is very, very obsessed over you, and that is going to be really amplified during the lunar eclipse. They're going to be thinking very deeply about you, really obsessing over every single thing, but feeling confused as well. Let's find out what are they going to be feeling confused about. Yeah. This person, they feel very deeply attracted to you and they want to have a very solid commitment. They're not looking to just get involved in some sort of passing affair or something that is like a one night stand or friends with benefit situation. This person is very, very serious. So they are unsure in terms of which direction to take the relationship in. They are unsure of how to approach you. So what can you do to bring this person closer? Tarot cards are showing love. It's also showing that there's a very high chance of both of you coming together in a commitment, a marriage, etc. How can you make this person open up? Well, you have to take a chance. That's what I'm seeing. You have to also understand that the situation is going to require you to put in some effort. And what is their ultimate goal? What are they looking to reach in the situation? They want to work things out. So this tarot card reading is focused on a handful of people. Of course, it's going to depend on your particular situation, but I'm definitely seeing from the cards that this lunar eclipse is going to have a very profound effect on certain people's lives. Some of you are dealing with someone who really wants to come back into your life, make things work, reconcile with you, and get things back on the right path. So pay attention to this individual if they're reaching out to you, if they're trying to communicate with you during this period of time. They're going to be feeling deeply emotional and this is going to be a window of opportunity to you know, get back together with this person if that's what you want. I hope you enjoyed your tarot card reading. If you want a personal one, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Remember to subscribe and have a wonderful day. Take care.